and that oh that is a beauty hold on brother hold on all right y'all our setup is slip bobber i got a little slide weight there swivel snail number two down to a minnow first cast mike don't know what it is first cast yeah Oh, it's a walleye. Got a little All right. You Not big enough to keep. Nice. Beautiful. Got to get bigger. There you go, Mike. Did you get it? What'd you get that time? A little walleye? Oh, perch. Nice. Got him. Don't know what it is. What is that? Oh, it's a per oh, he came off. I thought I had a fish. Look at that. Is that a little rock bass? Warm mouth, is that a or a rock bass? No, that's a little warm mouth. Hmm. A little warm mouth. It's a baby, y'all. It's a baby. Should throw him back out as bait on a circle hook. Oh, look at that, right? Mike, little crappie. He was running with it. It is a, that's a black crappie. Right in front of Jeff. Jeff, they're sitting in this pocket right in front of you. I caught my last three fish right there. You got them that time, don't you? Yeah, you got them that time. What you got? Is it a perch? Oh, yeah, a nice perch. Good job, Jeff. I'm gonna start calling you the Perch King. <laughs> Got him that time. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, little walleye. <laughs> the journey of the eight inches begins again. Oh, he's got a nice one over there, Mike. And he's got a nice one out there. All right, guys. I got two guys who, look at this. Got another big one, huh? Is that a walleye? Nice. Beautiful. Oh yeah. Nice. That's a 22 incher all day long. Got another white perch. Only problem is they keep getting smaller. Oh, that's a better fish. Is that a catfish? That's a catfish. Nope, I got a catfish. Come here, buddy. Easy, easy, I'm letting you go. All right, y'all, I'm gonna let this one go. There you go, buddy. Go get bigger. One of these times, it's gonna be a nice walleye. You know what I'm saying? There we go. Oh, what is that? That is not a, uh, I don't think that's a catfish, Jeff. I'm. I got something big, brother. What is that? I don't think that's a catfish. Oh, it's a big old catfish again. Two in a row. Never mind. I keep getting catfished. Guys, I keep getting catfished. Please don't do that. I know. All right, y'all. There's another one. Guys, one of the easy ways to remove a hook from a catfish. Just grab it right there. I'll try and get his whiskers. 
pop it right out. Okay, let's let that one go. I thought that one was a walleye because it, boom, it slammed it. Oh, what's that? But not a keeper though, huh? Still nice. Right species, wrong size. All right, y'all, we're chasing the elusive walleye and muskie that could be in this area. We're catching plenty of other ones besides that, but hopefully, hopefully we can hook into a decent one. There you go, Mike. What you got there? That's a walleye. Not a keeper, but it's a beautiful walleye. Oh, you got another nice one. Oh, whoo, beautiful. Good job, brother. You might have to try a different technique. That doesn't seem to be working. <laughs> Just that same one that you were using the other day? Oh, a gulp minnow? Nice. So right there it tells you, you don't have to go to artificial, Mike. He's using a gulp minnow. He's just, he's just jigging a gulp minnow. So we're, we're running the right bait. We're catching them right in there. Right, well I caught mine yesterday, like right in there. I think they're sitting on the bottom of these tailwaters, letting things just wash down to them. I think I'm gonna try to work this back edge over here. I'm gonna go down to like two feet. What'd you get, Jeff? Nice, good job. The Perch King. There we go. That's a bigger fit. Mike, I need a net, please. It is not a walleye, though, unfortunately. Guys, I'm just catching catfish after catfish. Come here. We've probably caught 50 of them in the last two days. Yeah. Yep, there's plenty of fish here. There's a giant muskie that was cruising the shore. Oh. He had to be up about 50 inches. He caught it yesterday. Up. And then we were, yeah, we were fishing here. Uh, a couple of kids were fishing with their parents, and I was helping them set up their poles, and it swam right up to the bank. Yep, that's what it was doing the other day. It had day. like, it's right either up. beat up had ulcers or something on its oh, back. Yeah, well, yeah. They get tore up around here. There's a lot of people that try to snag them and shit. Oh, but, are you allowed to snag them? No. I didn't think so. No. Yeah, that's never good. No. All right, let's let this one go. Uh, we're throwing minnows. We've been wearing them out on minnows. Yeah, the guy down there, he picked up a few walleye. He was jigging with the men out. It's a healthy body of water, so I'm excited about that. It really is. We're lucky to have one that's this decent around us. Here's what I did. I went to two feet. I fished that edge until I saw that it was bumping it. And then I came in about five feet in, and I went to three feet. And as soon as I did, that, that catfish slammed it. What I'm going to try to do is learn that edge right there. Because then the walleye should be sitting right on the bottom, right? And if I can figure out what depth they're sitting on the bottom, should be able to hopefully hook one. I'm working this edge here and slowly working my way deeper and seeing if I can't find where the walleye might be sitting in here. The young man over there has already caught two monster, well, two nice walleye, two definitely keepers. So that's our game plan. Keep working this edge. What'd you get, Mike? Is that a crappie? That's a massive crappie. Check that out, brother. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> little crappie little black crappie look at that guys little back black crappie nice there it is, guys, even in Pimatumine, I'm catching the elusive stick fish. That one's just a baby. Got a perch. Not big enough. Little perch. He said, I'm big. No, you're not. Go get bigger. Got another beautiful one, nice. Yeah. That guy knows how to catch fish, brother. Woo! 
Wait, you got a busky or you got a walleye? You got it? You need me to come over there and help you? So you're throwing a Mr. Twister. Yeah, I catch musky. Orange and black flake. Now, is that a one eighth or a quarter ounce? Quarter. Quarter? Yeah. Just bouncing it off the bottom, huh? Yeah, jig it. So catch muskies, wall, everything, you know, white bass. And once you feel it hit the rock, you just pick it back up? I just lift it up and let it fall and hit it on the fall. Okay, just a lot to, of people just reel them in, but I, just, I jig. So just a slow retrieve? Yeah. Just okay. lift it let it fall. Yeah, I'm watching you wear them out. I'm like, I gotta go see what he's doing. So that's what you caught the ones with the minnow, the other ones, right? No, uh, the little minnow. Yeah. There's a little one on the rod up there. Oh, you were catching them off of that? I catch walleyes on that all the time. What? Yeah, that's a crappy thing. Do you make this head? No, no I order them. You order them? Who do you order them for? You get them on the app? Chuck and Debs. Chuck here and in Ohio. Is, it? is there, do you have a website? Yeah, Chuck and Debs. Check it up. Chuck and Deb. Okay, that's the name of the website. Yep. Okay. They all kind of fish. They're cheaper than Cabela's or anything. And that's a 16th, huh? Yeah. Nice. And then that's just a regular Bobby. Is that a regular Bobby Garland? Yeah. That one is. Yeah, I'm just sitting there watching. I was I like, had okay. I a gold minnow on before that, and I switched to that when he caught that crappy. Okay. Crappies eat that, but I catch walleyes down here on them. Now the gulp minnow, what size are you using? Same as that, two inch. Two inch? Well, you, once again, brother, you're showing us all how to get it done. And some people just know how to fish. Do you mind if I take a look at the walleye you got? All right, y'all, I have not caught any walleye today. But this young man over here has, and he's gonna let us take a look at him. Oh yeah, look at those. Beautiful. Wow. Those are beautiful all day long, brother. Those are average for this kind of this area? Over in the lake, that's, that's, you know, these little ones? Uh -huh. I haven't seen all these little ones in here in 20 years like this. I don't well, know just, if they just stalked them. That's what I was thinking, they either just stalked them or they had a really good spawn. Yeah, I, no, they um, stalk this lake every year. Oh, okay. Because the hatcheries up where the spillway is where they feed the carp. Oh, okay, I didn't and know they, that. they milk these walleyes in the spring, they trap, they milk the muskies too. Huh. They put all the traps out in the lake. And then they stalk all the lakes in Pennsylvania just from the fish that catch in this lake. That's crazy. That means you can have a very good, healthy waterway. You got one? You need a net? Yeah. Okay, hold on, I'm coming. Hold on, brother. Give me a second. There you go. Just like that, that, guys. guys. <laughs> Go ahead, Can't brother. believe it. I was like, so the minnow works? Yeah. Hold on, brother. Hold on, Mike. Take your time. Oh, it's a big one. Like I said, take your time. I got to get over to you. All right, guys. Mike's got his second one. And that, oh, that is a beauty. Hold on, brother. Hold on. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, bring him back. Bring him back. Unbelievable. I think that's gonna be, yeah, it's definitely thicker than the first one. Un hey Mike. Believable. Tell my viewers what yeah, you what you're saying. Let me show you guys is. what we've done here. Don't take them out of the net though. Yep, let me do it this way. You get it through his gills. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what we're doing. Oh, it fell right out. There's the walleye. Show you what we're using for bait here. Okay, and you see that on the camera. That is a um, minnow gull. I don't know the exact name, with the jig head. We have it tied with the palomar knot. We're letting the jig head bump the bottom, and they just pull it up a little. Jig it, bump the bottom, jig it. Bump the bottom, jig it. And the walleye are hitting it. Beautiful. <laughs> Three casts, two walleye, unbelievable. Obviously the results are there. Look at that. Go ahead, brother, keep oh, going. Wow. Here we go. Got him. Finally got one, guys. <laughs> the walleye is just not big enough. Guys, got another walleye. Not what we're what we're looking for. Not the size we're looking for. You got him? Yeah, that's a fish. What do you got? Got a nice perch, probably. Mikey, come here. What? Why Mikey? I don't know, because I don't know how to 
That's a massive perch. Watch it. If I let that, go of this. Yeah, that's a massive perch. Dude. Let me get him in and then we'll check. Well, hold on. Drag. We're going to fix your drag. My drag right. is like zero. Hold him straight up. Hold him straight up. Hold him up. Look at that. My drag. You have your what? reverse on. <laughs> there. Now roll it up. You didn't hook in. <laughs> yeah, step up. There you go. What you got, Jeff? Another beautiful perch. A little warm. Oh, what is that? A little warm mouth. That is the darkest looking warm mouth I've ever seen in my life. It's a warm mouth. That is a warm mouth bluegill hybrid. Look at that, guys. Look at all this grass. Jeff caught a warm mouth bluegill hybrid. That is crazy. <laughs> Okay, he really wanted that because... Man, he wanted that one, didn't he? Look at that. How cool is that? You want that one for your aquarium? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, don't worry about it. Oh, that's a nice bird. Oh, yeah! Hold on, stop running around there, young man. Look. Look. What kind of what? Is that a is a that's not a buffalo it doesn't have the whiskers i have no idea it's there weird. is a it's not a common carp <laughs> ah, i can't remember the name of the kid called it yeah i've never seen that one before it's weird you guys have uh smartphones uh yeah i don't have my phone with me right now okay. though. we go to google oh it's a white sucker it's a white it's not sucker. a carp oh hey there you go i've never seen one of those before sucker, huh? it's a white sucker did you think you had a monster walleye at first? Yeah, I thought I had a walleye at first. And then you started seeing that color, you probably thought you had a muskie, huh? No, I saw the five dogs at both Does anyone ever catch a small muskie around here? I mean, they gotta be a baby. They're not, they're not just born and they're like 42 inches, are they? I mean, my, my mom caught like one that was like that big. Oh, she has? I told the other guy, he catches them all the time. He goes, I said, have you ever caught a little one? He goes, what do you mean? I said, they can't just come out, they're like 28 inches to start. Yeah. Oh yeah, some guy got a rainbow. Oh yeah, the guy showed me a picture of it. I was like. Oh, the big guy with the beard? Yeah. Yeah. I was like, what? Yeah, he caught like a seven pound walleye out here too. Yeah, he, well, he was fishing this morning. We came in and he was fishing around over there and he caught four, like 26 inch walleye. And we're like, he goes, I'll catch them all over here. And then he told us what to throw. He told us to throw this, uh, this is what he was catching them on. Really? Huh. That's crazy. Yeah, I watched him and I was like, so what are you throwing? And he showed me, I, it's going to be on my video. I'm just like, he goes, yeah. He goes, and then I'll throw a curly tail every now and then. And he just bounces it off the bottom. There we go. Oh yeah, Mike. Mike, net please. Ah, uh, it's rolling. It's a catfish. Catfish. Uh, you don't want to lose your gear. So. No. It's a nice catfish. No, it's not a bull. Oh, it is a bullhead. Uh, no? Yeah? I don't know. I think it's a blue cat. Oh, it's, a, it's a blue, I think. It's a blue or a channel. No, I'm okay with catching catfish. I don't want my picture taken. Away. I'm just, I'm trying to get walleye. You know? There's a fishing line across here. I could feel it slide on. Ooh, look at the war marks on that one, y'all. Okay, let's get you out of here. Let's get you back in the water, shall we? Got another one. What is that? That is running. That is not running like a catfish. I don't know. Another big old catfish. If I was trying to eat catfish tonight, it'd be a good night. Don't you stick me. All right. Look at that, guys. Another one. I don't know, Mike. I catch a couple more blue cats like that. I might just go ahead and cook them up. Feed them to Jeff over here. Oh, yeah. That's a bigger, that's a bigger catfish, y'all. Think I got another catfish. Oh, my goodness.
Wow. Mike, look at that one. Problem is, That's my biggest one yet. That could be the problem. Hey, y'all. Look at that thing. Mike says I'm using Meow Mix, y'all. He might be right. There you go. All right. Let's let that one go. What you got, Jeff? Got another perch? Yeah, I got another perch. Guys, Jeff is the perch king. Got him. I am wearing the catfish out. Mike, I'm wearing the catfish out, brother. All right, that's it. Hey, Mike, I'm going to keep a few of these. I'm going to cook them. At this point, I might as well. You got a walleye? Oh, Mike, are you kidding me? Look at this, guys. This is how you catch catfish upon my tumen, apparently. Yep. I know. I just caught your cousin. I caught your cousin. He didn't make it back. Guys, that one's got some damage to it. We're not going to keep this one. Better to be safe than sorry. Let me go ahead and let this one go. Go get bigger, buddy. That's all I'm doing for this setup to catch these catfish. Slip bobber, Aberdeen hook, minnow. We're about three and a half feet deep. A keeper crappie? All right, good job, Mike. Got him. Oh yeah, there's another one, y'all. Jeff. Oh man. Jeff got a beautiful perch, y'all. And why, guys? We just tripled up. Look at that. Mike, you got a crappie. Jeff got a perch. I got a catfish. Beautiful. There we go. Would I love to catch a walleye and eat walleye tonight? Absolutely. That just doesn't seem to be in the cards right now. But we still got an hour or two of daylight. We'll see what happens. Got him. Mike, you can't make this stuff up, brother. Just one after the other. That one's a bullhead. That one's going back. We don't eat bullheads. And it's got a big tumor on its belly right there. Can y'all see that? Yeah, we don't eat bullheads. Tuxedo, look how dark they are. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Woo. That is what I'm talking about. Look at that. All right, y'all. There we go. That's probably the biggest one I've caught so far. They are. And I'm taking full advantage of it. Okay. No one rained on your parade. There we go. Oh, yeah. That is a nice catfish. Oh, yeah. Come on, baby. Oh, what is that? Is that a, that's a catfish? What is that? Yeah, it is. It's a catfish. This one is pretty beat up. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh. They keep getting bigger. Good Lord. Yep, broke the line that time. Woo. Look at that one. There he is. Oh, yeah.
All right, y'all. Here we go. Beautiful. There it is. And that is a beautiful one. To All right. Look at that. Rop, rop, rop. I wasn't looking for another one, but I got another one anyway. Surprise, surprise. A catfish. Y'all, they are they are loaded up in here. Go ahead and let that one go. I'll let that one go get bigger. All right, guys, this is a good fighter. See what kind of catfish this is going to be. Oh, yeah. Come here, baby. Can y'all see that? Yep. All right. Dude, I'm wearing them out. Oh, at least 10. Beautiful. Look at it. Let that one go get bigger. Oh, what is that? Oh my goodness. Please tell me that's a walleye, not a catfish. There's a lot of catfish in here. Nobody keeps them. Well, at least he detached himself. Let's let that one go.